Hey, what's up you guys? It's Kev. It's also 1000 degrees where I am right now, so please bear with me. I'm, I'm dying of heat and I don't know what to do. It's only spring. Um, I feel like global warming is very real right now. Anyway, so why I'm here today is I'm kind of updating you on the ring light situation that I had. Like a lot of you guys saw last week that um, my ring light had broken and I ordered a new globe. And now I got a few messages. Um, thank you so much to all my friends and subscribers who messaged me saying like what I could do in the interim until I get my ring light, which I have got right now. Um, as you can see, it's pretty lit. Um, so yeah, so this is it. Like my ring lights back, I've got great lighting and I've got my new camera, new tripod. And like, this is everything I need right now. I'm so happy to actually have just like my equipment back up and running like things that actually work i'm no longer stressing i'm no longer like frustrated um it's just great but that's like this is not the point of the videos why i'm here to like kind of talk you through my ring light process is because i used a new service called aramax global shopper now this service is great to me um i've used it for the second time now um the first time I ordered like a jacket and the second time I ordered my globe for my ring light. So obviously like my first video was actually going to be on the jacket and then when I had the whole ring light situation, like not being able to find the globe in my country, I was like, you know what, this hits home way more than a jacket being ordered from a different country. I'm going to do and review um, Aramax Global Shopper for my ring light. So Basically what it is, is a service in South Africa or pretty much around the world. Um, I'm not 100% sure on that, but it gives you a list of around over 18 to 20 plus addresses where you can order online and send your parcels to that location. So because I'm in South Africa, I wanted to order my ring light globe from Amazon UK, where I originally got my ring light from. So the problem with that is that customs take forever and a day to bring your things through to um, South Africa and obviously uh, deliver it to your house. So what could take you, um, you know, two or three days to receive a parcel in the UK or in America or wherever else, it'll take about two or three months here. Uh, that's guaranteeing, you know, um, the fact that you may not even get it, uh, which has happened to me on more than one occasion. Um, I'm not even throwing shade to the South African post office. I'm just telling the truth. And, um, you know, that's just the way it is. You know, they're really rough with your items. I've received a lot of broken items, like things that weren't even expensive or meaningful were just, you know, delivered broken or, you know, weren't delivered at all. And so, for me, I needed to find a solution fast and I just randomly came across Aramax Global Shopper and I have been obsessed ever since. So I just keep looking at my ring light now because I'm just so happy that it's back. And yeah, so this is what it is. So um, I wanted this ring light. So in order for me to you know, go through the Aramax Global Shopper process, I thought I'd kind of like fill you in, give you a tutorial on how to do it and um, why I'm so like obsessed with it. So I ordered this ring light on the 29th of August. Um, my ring light broke on the 28th of August. So that's how quick I was. Like next morning I hopped onto my computer. I'm like, Aramax, please help me out. I went onto Amazon. I'm like, ring light globe, like order, deliver. So I ordered um, the globe. There was no kind of like fast shipping option on Amazon, unfortunately, um, because they had to kind of get a globe from the source as well. So um, it kind of took about five days for Amazon to deliver this globe to the Aramex um, postal like kind of office in London. Um, so here's the parcel here. I actually wanted to see eh, where they delivered it to. So here was how big my ring light was and they delivered it to the Aramax address in the United Kingdom. I can't really find like the, hmm, hold on, Col Colnbrook. So that's where they delivered it to um, in the United Kingdom. And so, yeah, that took about five days because there was no option of like an expedited shipping, you know, option like overnight shipping thing. Otherwise, trust me, I would have taken it. And so it got to Aramax on, um, I think it must have been around the 4th or 5th of September. And for me, that was like, okay, like I didn't have a problem with that. Like that's Amazon's thing. And so like, 
I was like hoping for it to come really quickly to SA after that, which it really did. So after that, Amazon um, immediately emailed me. They were like, your parcel's here with us. Um, the only thing we need right now from you is your invoice. So if you can see on the box once again, Amazon, um, I mean, Aramax needs your invoice to just like, you know, say that you've like bought it and that they just want that in case like when they bring it into the country like customs and specs that like they want you to have a receipt um you know with the product just in case which i completely understand so that's cool so like when you order a product just make sure that you save your receipt save it in microsoft word and i save it on my desktop all the time and then yeah um all you do is once you get that email you send them your receipt and then they pretty much send it straight away so um I got to them on around the 5th or 6th of September, I think, if I remember correctly. And I got it pretty much instantly. Like, I got it on last week. When was it? I got it, like, last week, Thursday, which was the 7th, if I'm not mistaken. 7th of September. So, you know, that's pretty much an instant overnight international delivery right to my door. And for me, that is pretty damn special because... I have never been used to such a good service in my life, like especially when it comes to, you know, importing things or bringing things in. Um, you know, for me, the price is worth it. It may be a little pricey to some people, but um, if you're ordering really small things, like there's no like big hang ups or anything. So what I ordered here was like a globe, which wasn't really heavy. Like I, I think it only ended up being like 1.5 kilograms and Aramax charges you per kilogram. So um or per like 0 0.5 kilograms so i only ended up paying like i think around 350 for this to be you know brought in from london straight to my doorstep in south africa and it was overnight so you know if you're thinking about it in terms of you know the amount of traveling that this thing has done um you can really actually say that you know 350 is not a lot of money at all to bring something into the country um, you know, in that amount of time. So unfortunately, like there's not gonna really be an unboxing to this process, but like you can see here that this is the box. Um, it's got like Aramax Global Shopper all over the, like the tape, it's like branded. Um, you can see here, I think it says Shop and Ship. That's pretty cool, powered by Aramax. Um, you can see here's my receipt in case Customs wants to check it out. And then there was my address, which I just blanked out for obvious reasons. And then on the other side here was um, the Aramax address. This was obviously directly from Amazon. Um, and yeah, you know what? The Globe um, on the on Amazon, it said that a lot of people received their Globe and it was like in pieces, it was shattered. And so that was actually a really big risk that I took bringing it into the country. I was really scared um, to bring it in, but you know what? It came in a really strong plastic molded kind of cover, which I had to unscrew to open. Around that there was um, a box, around that there was like paper, and then around that again was, like I said, the other huge box, which, you know, I'm really proud that Aramax like repackaged it. They knew that it was gonna be taking quite a trip. So I think they just wanted to like double check that, um, you know, that it would be safe coming here, um, which I'm really appreciative for. You know what, um, if somebody goes through that amount of effort to make sure that my stuff gets here safely, then I will continue to, you know, keep using them again. And you know what, for me, 350 may be pricey to some. Like, I initially thought it was, like, pricey, but then, you know, when I thought about it in the back of my head, um, you know, at 350 to bring something like this and it's so well protected, so fast, I, you know, I don't often say how much I love stuff, but I... I love the service and I hope you guys do too. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna leave you a link down below. I want you to go check it out. Um, I don't have a promo code for you guys as of yet, but if I do, you can totally follow my um, social handles and I'm gonna see if I can maybe grab a promo code for you guys to see if you wanna sign up. But in the meantime, sign up is $45. That's not much at all, um, considering that it's like a lifetime membership. So. Just remember that it's a lifetime membership. Sign up once and you get the service forever and ever and ever until you die. Um, <laughs> probably not the best way to end it off. But yeah, so you know what? I'm really happy. And what's cool about it as well is that you do get a um, an app on your phone which lets you, you know, stay up to date with everything that's happening. Um, I'm gonna open it for you guys quick once I find it. I put it under my shopping app. And yeah, uh, AGS, Aramax Global Shopper, right there, you know, and then it lets you log in, 
Okay, so once you've logged in, it comes up with a screen looking like this. Um, it says my packages, my addresses, office locator, my profile settings, and then obviously like the help tab. So um, say you want to order like a pair of shoes and these shoes are in, you know, China or Japan. You can click on my addresses and it brings up a full list of, you know, addresses around the world that you can click on. Say your shoes are from Japan, you can click right here, it says Japan and it gives you like the full list um, of like info and details that you need to type in. So instead of typing in your home address, you'll type in the Aramex address and they will forward it to your house instead of, you know, the country um, bringing it in, going through customs, taking forever. Um, yeah, that's basically like the gist of how it works. And um, like I said, with this app, you know what, Amazon keeps me updated along the way. It shows me like who it's been delivered to. Like you can see uh, um, delivered to Brenda, which is my mommy. And I'm really happy that um, I've found the service and that it's actually really good. So yeah, I mean, I'm gonna give credit where credit is due. I'm gonna say, you know, there's no real cons of the service except for, you know, the heavier that your parcel is, the more that you may pay. But I think that's pretty standard with any courier or shipping service that you experience. And yeah, that's all I really wanted to say. I really wanted to make a video on this because I know a lot of my friends and a lot of my family really do love bringing in parcels and, you know, even things like sweets or just like random bits and pieces that you can't get in the country. And so, yeah, I thought I'd share it with you. Um, it's great for ladies who want to buy like makeup. I know all my beauty blogger friends are bringing, um, you know, things like Kylie lip kits and ColourPop items in. And yeah, that's it for me, guys. Like, um, I want to say thank you, Aramax Global Shopper, for your wonderful service. And I want to say thank you for helping me bring in my ring light um, when I thought there was no way I would be able to light up my YouTube videos ever again. So, you guys, that's it for me. I hope you have a wonderful day further. And yeah, let me know down below if you um, shop a lot online, especially from overseas, and how you bring it in. But otherwise, I'm going to leave all the links down below. You can go check out the Aramax Global Shopper website. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I love you guys and have a great day. Mwah.